You know there comes a time in every person's life when you gotta realize that sometimes faith, it's just not enough. And honestly, my faith in 7 Deadly Sins Season 3 redeeming itself it's basically non-existent at this point. Now, a lot of you guys don't know this, but I actually like Seven Deadly Sins. I would probably go as far to say as I'm a fan of Seven Deadly Sins. I haven't read the manga, but I've watched the anime. I thought season one and season two were really good. I thoroughly enjoy Seven Deadly Sins. Now, some of you guys follow me on Twitter, you probably, you know, know that I've been memeing the animation, you know, in Seven Deadly Sins season three, taking a jab at it, you know, here and there. But in reality, guys, your, your, boy, your boy is hurting. I am hurting because we, I, I believe that hate comes from love and the reason I meme on 7 Deadly Sins Season 3 so much is because I want it to succeed. I want it to be good because Season 2 left off on such a good in note in my opinion because we got to see Meliodas. He got this, this new demon form type of deal like he unlocked some of his new powers and stuff like that and I was ready. I was ready to see exactly how they would take on the Ten Commandments and stuff like that because I thought the Ten Commandments, that was a good ass, like that, that was a good, you know, like t villain team or whatever else you want to call it. But, oh my god, oh my god, dude, I was so wrong because all the screenshots that I see on Twitter, all the animation clips that I've seen, we really going outside like this, huh? We really going outside, Seven Deadly. I don't know if Studio Dean is feeding their animators, bro. Can I order you guys a fucking pizza? You guys need to eat, drink, bro. I will do anything for you guys. Do you need help? I don't know what it is. Because Dean, you know, they did Konosuba. And I'm not saying Konosuba is the best animation out there, but Konosuba, I fucks with Konosuba, bro. Studio Dean, I think you did a damn good job with that. But Seven Deadly? Maybe that's just not your cup of tea, bro, because honestly, I know A1 Pictures is not the best animation team out there. Trust me, I know that, you know, they have their fair share of flaws and all that. But, bro, what do, what do I gotta give to get A1 back, bro? A1, please, I love you, man. Come back to us. Now, I'm not really one to shit on an anime because I believe that everyone likes different things. But, like, I gotta talk about this because... I'm not shitting on it right now. I'm pointing out what exactly is wrong with season three right now Because bro listen the Escanor and Meliodas fight people told me that was one of the most hyped moments of the series and it looks like this Bro Bro, I was waiting for this fight too. People told me this was hype. Escanor got introduced, and Escanor is like the strongest one in in um, all of Seven Deadly. And I was surprised. I'm like, bro, I thought Meliodas was the goat. And you tell me Escanor is stronger than him, and then Meliodas gets his new demon power shit. I'm like, okay, they about to go head to head, and a little like this, huh? Meliodas, what did they do to you, man? Bon, Merlin, wh wh what is this? This is not my Seven Deadly. N now listen, I don't bag anybody for enjoying the newest season of Seven Deadly. I'm not saying that all of it looks trash or whatever, everything is, is bad. I mean, there's probably some clips in there of, you know, the third season that probably looks good. I mean, I, you know, people still enjoy it. I mean, obviously they're still putting out episodes, which leads me to another thing, bro. Who is on, who, who is allowing these episodes to air? Cause you know when they air, right? People are people are not dumb. They're gonna see some of these, some of these screenshots that look like this, man. I'm just wondering who who is making these decisions, bro? Because you and me, we gotta have a talk, man. We we gotta have a talk. I'm being real. I'm trying to save your guys' life out here, man. Cause it's rough in these Twitter streets, bro. They don't give a fuck out here. World War Three starting and everything. People really don't give a fuck out here. I'm trying to save your guys' life. I want to see my Seven Deadly Sins season three prosper. I don't know if there's gonna be a season four or anything. Cause like I said, I don't read the manga, so I don't know exactly how long it is. But judging from season three. I don't even know if I want to continue this, bro. Because look, when I first watched, I watched about maybe three episodes of Seven Deadly, uh, uh, the third season of Seven Deadly, right? I only watched like three episodes at first, when it was first airing, of course. Um, and you know, I, I saw the opening. I'm like, the opening slap. They got Overworld on it. I'm like, okay, this is clean. I like that. You know, even if they're doing the little T pose thing. I mean, I thought that was it was all right. I mean, people, I saw people complaining about that, but. Yeah, I thought it was okay. I mean, the, the opening slaps, though. The song slaps. Opening in my eyes. It's cool. It's cool. First episode, they got some white blood, some censorship. I'm like, ugh. 
I don't know about that, Dean. I mean, for me, it really wasn't that bad. But obviously, with blood, uh, you, I, I feel like you kind of need blood because Seven Deadly Sins gets pretty visceral at times. And I feel like you need that to convey um, emotions across. So, you know, when they stab somebody and some white goop comes out, obviously, I'm going to think, like, what the hell am I watching right now? So I think they fixed that, though. Um, I, I believe they fixed that. If they didn't, well, I... I, I don't really know what they're doing. And then after that, I'm like, okay, you know, maybe, maybe they got this down. You know, I'm gonna take a little break. You know, I'll come back to Seven Deadly, uh, you know, when more episodes air out and I'll watch it. And I come back, I see the Meliodas in, in Escanor fight air. Shit was trash. I'm just, I'm keeping it real, bro. Shit was trash. I don't know what they were thinking with that. Fucking fan animations look better than that, bro. Various other screenshots come out. Meliodas look like a fucking, I don't even know, Mr. Potato Man with his discombobulated ass limbs. I don't even know, bro. Like, they got some derpy-ass faces. I'm just... I'm, I'm, I'm just sad. I'm honestly just sad. It honestly just gives me depression that a, se that a series that I really was looking forward to. You know, I've recommended to a lot of friends that, bro, Seven Deadly Sins is pretty nice. And, you know, you should give it a try. This is not helping my cause, Dean. Once again, bro, are you feeding your animators? Do I need to order you guys a pizza or something, bro? Because I know you guys aren't... Like, this is not your top skill level, bro. Like, there's just no way that this is your top skill level. Because I don't know why you would air these things out, bro. I'm just saying. I know you guys can do better. Uh, Seven Ellie since Season 3. I, I damn near gave, gave up on it. It's 2020. World War 3. It's starting. Seven Ellie Sins, it's still trash, bro. We really going outside like this, huh? You really hate to see it. Now, I'm not no anime expertise, no anime insider or stuff like that, bro. Like, of course, as a viewer, I don't know what goes on behind the scenes of Studio Dean and all that stuff. And, you know, like them handing the, the rights and stuff and, you know, and the budget and, and, you know, distributing the anime and all the technical stuff. Of course, I don't know about that. So I'm only speaking from a viewer standpoint. And from a viewer standpoint, it's just not cutting it. And I feel like a lot of people agree on that, bro. But like I said before, if you enjoy season three, all power to you, bro. Like, I'm not saying I still fucks with Seven Deadly. Trust me, I still fucks with it. But this season's animation, dude, it ain't it. It ain't it, Chief. I would have rather them took like a like a hiatus or something to get everything sorted out, bro. Rather than just push these episodes out with this quality and just knowing people are gonna rip them apart for it because it's not looking too good out here in these streets, bro. Us Seven Deadly Sins fans, we suffering out here, bro. We really suffering. We really going outside. And it's a shame because Seven Deadly Sins is such a promising series. And it's not really as popular, I think. It's not really as popular. I, I, like I said, I don't read the manga. But the anime, a lot of my friends or like a lot of people that I talk to don't really watch Seven Deadly. So, like I said, I, I, Seven Deadly for me was really good. It was a, it was a good-ass underdog series. And it's a shame it's going out like this, bro. But anyways, guys, um, let me know if you guys are watching Seven Deadly Sins Season 3 in the comments below. Let me know your thoughts on it so far, if I'm missing something, or if you guys know something that I don't know. Like I said, I'm only speaking from a viewer standpoint. Obviously, I'm not trashing any of the animators and stuff like that. Like, I'm making jokes about the, the eating and stuff like that. Hopefully, all the animators are being treated, you know, fairly, you know, taken good care of because they, they put in that work, bro. We go Shout out to all my animators out there. You know, whether you're doing it big in the studios or, you know, fan animations, all that. Dude, shout out to you guys because you guys do some work, stuff that I could never do in my entire life. But... Like I said, dude, let me know in the comments down below what you think. Hope you guys have a great day. And I don't know. Hashtag pray for, I don't know, hashtag pray for seven deadly. I don't know. P please. You hate to see it, man.